Hello, today I want to introduce a really cool but still experimental feature of Gradle, the Gradle Demon. This morning I gave a Gradle talk, but during my live demo I somehow buggered the part with the Gradle Demon. So this screencast is all about whitewashing the Demon's reputation and of course showing cool things with Gradle. When you repeatedly run a Gradle build, in my example here, on a very simple Java project. I'm sure you already noticed the incremental build feature which skips task execution if the input and the output of a task hasn't changed since the last time you executed it. This can save you a lot of time. In the example here it's twice as fast but the example contains only one JUnit test. I hope in your real world projects you have some more of them. As you can see, Gradle skips all tasks since everything on our build is up to date. So, starting Gradle, generating the task execution graph, and finally skipping all tasks takes about 5 seconds on my machine. Let's see if we can achieve this in less than a second. Therefore, I run my Gradle build with a dash dash daemon option. This starts a daemon process which even keeps running after my build is done. When executing the same command again, Gradle just passes the arguments to the already running daemon and the build is executed immediately without the whole JVM startup over it. So let's try if my machine can achieve the promised build in less than a second. And here we are. To stop the daemon we just have to run Gradle dash dash stop. For better illustration of this whole daemon stuff, let's start the daemon process in the foreground of our bash by executing gradle dash dash foreground. Now we have our daemon process on the left waiting for requests and our command line on the right. When executing gradle build dash dash daemon again, on our command line we can now see that uh, the process outputs the same as we have on the right. Running the build again without the dash dash daemon option we can see that the uh, daemon isn't triggered and the build takes longer to execute. So that was my brief introduction of the Gradle daemon. I hope you enjoyed it. It's a at the risk of repeating myself, feedback is appreciated. You can leave a comment, drop me a line via email or send a tweet. Bye bye.